Hi, my name is Caitlin McDonald. I'm here with the Social Speak Network. And today we're going to be driving into how to get the advanced layout editor working again on your Enfold theme website after WordPress has updated to WordPress 5. So if you're not in your WordPress site every day, um, you might jump in there uh, now that WordPress has automatically updated all the websites to WordPress 5 and see that there is now a block editor and that all of the Enfold advanced layout editor short codes now appear kind of in blocks and they're trying to force you to do it another way. It's awesome that WordPress updated their interface. Um, however, we use Enfold because we like how it, that works with the advanced layout builder and all of their uh, functionality. So I'm gonna jump on over to share my screen. It's just an easy plugin that you utilize to make the update. Uh, you could also do some CSS code. Um, so whichever one you feel more comfortable with. Um, and so here I have just a, a dev website um, for our business. And, and as you can see, the layout is not how you would want it to be. Um, it has the Avia short codes in here. Does not look how we would want it to be, even though the page itself will come up properly. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add a new plugin. And this is called the content editor. Let's see. And it's, oops, excuse me, classic editor. Um, and so it's by WordPress contributors. So classic editor is what you want. And if you click install in here, let me just show you. Um, so it, the, the layout looks just fine um, on this page. It's just that that block editor was there. So I click to install the classic editor, and then I'm going to activate it. And then all you have to do is just verify within the settings that it is, and this is just in the writing settings, that the default editor for the users is the classic editor here. Um, and for most of us, it, we don't want people to switch back and forth between using uh, two different editors, so you can just save this as no. I'm just going to click Save Changes um, just to ensure that it does actually save there. And then if we go back and edit this page, what we will see is we are back to the advanced layout editor, the Avia Layout Builder. So again, the um, process for updating um, the website so that we see the typical Enfold options is fairly straightforward with that classic editor. Again, you can also utilize CSS to hide the layout builder that WordPress 5 um, automatically installs. And the plugin is only good until 2021. I believe if you do update your Enfold theme to the most recent uh, downloads that it does allow you to switch back and forth and hide the layout builder, um, excuse me, the block builder that WordPress installs. So first and foremost, jump on into your Enfold theme settings. See, I have an update here, and just update that. That's probably the best thing to do first and foremost. Then you can, if you have any trouble with that, um, you can go ahead and utilize the plugin, uh, the classic editor plugin. Again, this just works until 2021, and they'll be phasing it out. Um, and then for new websites, just be aware that you will be seeing that block uh, layout builder from WordPress 5. So again, my name's Caitlin McDonald. I'm here with the Social Speak Network. If this video has been um, interesting and informative to you, I urge you to subscribe to our YouTube channel. I'm always putting up other videos about uh, the Enfold theme and how you can best um, have advanced functionality with the theme for your business. Additionally, we do have a Facebook group. Um, if you're joining us for our kind of more of the marketing management um, and the link is down below. Uh, if you have any questions or comments as you're going through this, 
please feel free to add a comment, a question down below, and I will be sure to answer it. Thanks so much for tuning in, and I will see you next time.